I like our attention to detail. I like how we, uh, I mean, we didn't get a lot of plays perfect, but we made the second and third efforts. And um, they didn't destroy us on the offensive rebound. So that showed that we were in boxing out. That was an emphasis for us. Uh, but for the most part, we just did what we were supposed to do. We went two at home. Now we got to see if this game is going to travel on the road for us, and we got to stay locked in. We just want to come in and just break their rhythm a little bit, understand that, the, you know, runs are going to happen. They're on their home floor. You know, th those guys are looking for a response game. Uh, and, and we just got to be prepared. That is, it's simple. You know, the fans aren't going to come on the court and block anybody's shots or, or do anything, uh, but they're going to be loud. And uh, that makes a difference in our communication. So we just got to make sure doing those little things. Well, oh, you know, you're down 25, you're down 30. You know, uh, at the end of the day, it's like five, six minutes left. You know that uh, it's hard to get back to this game. And uh, at the end of the day, if you lose by one or you lose by 30, it's still the same thing. It's still lose, you know? So uh, at one point, like, the frustration goes away. You got to you gotta focus in um, when the game is over. Like, how can you take care of your body? How can you talk to your teammates? How can you touch one another and uh, pick everybody up? Uh, I mean, the frustration goes away, you know. Obviously, early in the game, obviously, you're a little bit frustrated when you not knock down shots as a team. But, uh, you know, when they're up 25, 30, five minutes left, you see in the bench, there, there's no frustration. The game is over, you know. So, um, as I say, you just got to, you know, focus on um, what the team can do better. How can you pick yourself up, your teammates up, and um, get them ready for game three?